Hello, konnichiwa, miyasan, uh, mindes. Um, to all the kids in Stosfas, um, I think you guys may be going through something, but I still want to record this for you guys. Um, so today, we're going to learn about how do we say hi and bye and in restaurant. Um, if you guys go to a Japanese restaurant, what should you guys do? So, hajime mashou ka? Let's start. Junbi wo ii desu ka? You guys, I hope you guys still remember, right? Ikimas, that means I'm ready or let's go. Jumbi or Ideska, I'm asking, are you ready? And you should say hi, right? So hi means yes. And let me pull up. Thanks. Okay, so we're going to learn from video. So um, you guys can go through this. So if you go to a restaurant, that's what it is, what you have to do. So when you order a table, you remember have to say, right? When you go to a restaurant, you have to book a table. Hello? Hello? Hello, can you hear me? Hello, I can. Hi, how are you guys doing? Hey, we're doing well, man. How are yeah. you doing? Miss you guys a lot. It's Sharon, Elizabeth, and Johnny, and everyone doing okay? Yeah. You guys doing okay? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. That's good. Missed you guys. Let me get this plugged in. No. Sure, okay, something. So today we are going to learn how do we say hi and bye? How do we talk in the restaurant? Okay, so you guys ready for that? You guys ready? Yeah. Okay. There you go. I'm going to set this up so you can see. Just that, say, that's just say stuff hi. There. Hi. Hi. Jimbio, eat us, ka? Hi. Okay, hi. Before, before we do it, let's pray first. Okay. Okay. Uh, dear Heavenly Father, uh, I ask that you help us to all learn Japanese, um, help Sharon, help Johnny, help Elizabeth to revise what they have learned and will do it to a glory of yours and help us to worship you and help this time to be joyful and edifying. In Christ's name I pray. Everyone say. Amen. Amen. I missed you guys so much. <laughs> That's how, how, do you know how you say that in Japanese? No. Aitakata. So let me type it on the screen. If I can do that. Aitakata. Can you guys say that? Aitakata. Aitakata. Okay. Remember how to say ah? What is this? Can you see the screen? Yes. Okay. What is this? That isn't ah. Ah, okay. What about this? E. E. Good job. Good job. High five. Good job. Uh, I. I. There's two dots on a top. What is this first? What is what is this? It's a ta, right? Ta. Yeah. I ta, but if you add two dots, what does it turn to? Ga. 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 Da, right? Da. D A, right? So this is ta, but if you add two dots, this is T A, right? Ta. But if you add two dots, that turns to da, right? I da ka. What is K A ka? What does it? look like draw it in the air oh, right ka looks like this you guys need to review we need to review the song afterwards can you guess what's what's the last one 
会いたかった。It's another dot, right? 会いたかった。Yeah, it's one of those. Yeah, it's one of those. So this means, I hope you guys take notes. I, I'm not here personally, but you guys have to take notes、um, for the glory of God. Take notes. I d a k a t a means I missed you. I really want to meet you. That's what I want to say to you guys. Is it hot over there? Atsui d e s k a Atsui d e s k a Either you say hi or yeah. Okay, so, so make notes of this too. So, hi looks like this. This is yes. Okay. Hi, yes. Okay. Taking notes. This is yes. Okay. Hi. And no. Do you guys know how to say no? Because the Bible said, let your yes be yes, let your no be no, right? So, we got to learn how to say no. Yet.、Yeah. Everyone say, yeah. 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 That sounds like, yeah, but it's it's not. It means no. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So you just learned so far. I missed you. I want to meet you, right? Or I missed you. I takata. Everyone say, I takata. I takata. I takata. I だかった。And if you want to say, do you guys miss me? Yeah. Okay. So if you want to say Ming, I missed you. You know how to say it? No. No. Right. You say Ming san. Okay.、Um, that's what Kazuki called me. If you guys met Kazuki,、um, this is hiragana. You write people's name in hiragana. If I write,、um, actually. This is katakana. I mean, so katakana. Remember in the flip of the handout, you guys see this is、um, kata, hi, well, hiragana. Katakana looks like this, and hiragana looks like, looks like this. So you can say,、uh, min san. Right, mean san, I da gata. Mean san, I da gata. And if I say Sharon, I da gata. Sharon, I da gata ne. And if I say Johnny, I missed you. Johnny, I da gata. And if I say Elizabeth, I miss you. Elizabeth, I da gata. Right? And if I say everyone, do you, do you know how to say everyone? No. Okay, if you don't, take notes. So everyone is minna san. Try to spell it in your book. Okay, minna san. Minna san. Okay. Give you guys a few seconds to write your answer. Okay, Elizabeth, show me what you got. We're just writing everyone. <laughs> um, just tell me, yeah, each of the characters of Minna san, what does it, what does it have? Minna-san, right? Minna-san. So if it's if it's Ming-san, Ming-san, right? We just you just learn how to say my name. Well, I I I don't think I should use pink. Uh, I'll use blue. Okay, Ming's color is blue. Okay. So if I write it in. If I write in katak hiragana, it is like this: min and san. 
right? Look at the, did you guys see the blue? Hi. Aoyo amita maska. Aoi. Hi. 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 Good job, good job. <laughs> high five, high five to that. Hi. So, mean san, right? This is, this is mean san in, um, in the hiragana. So how about when we are going to say minasan, right? Minasan is everyone, right? So that's that's what it looks like, minasan. But everyone, for everyone, it is minasan, right? Did you guys see this? Minasan. Minasan, minasan, right? So minasan can be written like this. Me, like you start with a me, right? Me, and then the N sound, min, right? And then na, write this on your notebook too. Minna-san, minna-san. Minna-san, aitakata. I missed y'all. <laughs> you guys got it? What is I missed you all in Japanese? Minasan. Aita kata. Minasan, aita kata. Okay. And this is in the kanji. So how do you write that kanji? Because there's, when you read higher level Japanese, there are things called kanji, and this is one of them. This we, means meat. Uh, I, right? I, it replaced which one? Which one did it replaced? Is it this one? So look at the blue here. And look at here, Aitakata, it's the same thing, right? Except we erase this, right? Aitakata. So if we replace that, this is the kanji of this. So if you see Aitakata, if you don't know what this spells, just kind of just say Aitakata, right? And then, okay, what does it mean? It, it's it's replacing the I the okay. gata. It's replacing this. Okay. This is I. Okay. So today let's watch a video. Um, first we need to sing our song first. Okay, remember the song. The number remember one. The song? Yeah. Ah, e u at all. Okay. Let's do it. <laughs> Remember that one? Ah, e u e o ka ki ku ke ko. Na shi su te so. Na shi su te so. Na mi Let's let's listen to the music. Let's let's go for it. Okay. We touch my show. We try to sing. Are you at all? Kaki kuke ka sashi suze so. Nani nune no, kani nune no, hari hu he ho. Nami mume mo, ya yu yo. Okay, let's go. Are you a Kaki Kuke? Sashi Suze so. Sashi Suze so. Nani Nune no. Hahi Huhe ho. 
Mommy Moon Memo. Ya, you, yo. Right, ya, ya, you, yo. Don't forget that. This is la, li, lu. What is this? What is this, guys? What is the the fourth one? What is this? What is this? Re. Re. Yes, re. La, li, lu, le, lo. It always it's a, e, u, e, o, but you just add a sound before that. Okay. So let's go to let's go to um restaurant if we can. You guys ready to go to a Japanese restaurant? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Um. <coughs> wow. Well, okay. Uh, Nancy, please move. I didn't be able to see Mr. Ming. Daddy, come to me. I know you can't right now because he's showing you a screen, but you need to get back to the children's seat. Daddy, where can I go? Okay, we'll order at a restaurant. Can you guys see this? So we're gonna learn just this, okay? We're gonna learn kore kudasai. Kore kudasai. Kore o kudasai. This means please uh, give me some of this. And when you go to a Japanese restaurant, they're gonna ask you, how many people do you have on the table, right? And it's gonna be nan me sama desu ka? So nan. Me. Name sama. Name sama desu ka? And uh, kore o kudasai. This means please. Right? If you guys ask for, let's say, what's your favorite food, Johnny? What did mama cook you yesterday? You remember the sandwich? Sandwich? We had a sandwich yesterday, but we made our stuff. What about for dinner? What did mommy make us for dinner? Us brownies. Okay. And they were good. You like those? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but my favorite food is ice cream. Or okay. So if you asked in a restaurant, you got to take notes, okay? Ice cream. Mm -hmm. How do you say ice cream? Ice cream. Ice cream. Did you guys see the screen? Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Okay, I'll type it on the, let's type everyone's favorite food before you go order, right? Because before you go order in a restaurant, you got to know what you want, okay? So, ice cream is ice cream. But you got to eat something else than ice cream, right? Let's say pizza, okay? Pizza. We're having pizza for dinner tonight because we went out to get something yesterday night. But then, yeah. but then when we got there... The man wasn't there to help us get a freezer, so we just left. We went oh, out there for okay. beforehand, and he still wasn't there. Oh, yeah, and he was closed. But you still have other things to eat, praise God. Yes. It's a good thing pizza isn't the only thing to eat. <laughs> yeah. So, so everyone, this is a question for everyone. If you are going to order pizza in a Japanese restaurant, how do you say that? Pizza. 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 That doesn't work. That's that's pizza. That's good job. But if you go to a restaurant and you just 
you just look at the person and say pizza what is he gonna <laughs> tell you he's gonna say that's kind of weird this is a weird person right we gotta have manners right so can i have a pizza please right how do you say it in english like ask for a pizza nicely can i have a pizza can i please have pizza can i have a pizza right please right so how you say it in japanese is pizza pizza or kudasai Pizza. Can everyone say pizza, pizza. or kudasai? Pizza or kudasai? Pizza or kudasai? Pizza or kudasai? Now, how about, how about Sharon? What's your favorite food? How about Sharon? Mm. Sharon, yes. you, we'll give you pink. Do you like pink? Yeah. Okay. Uh, sorry, Johnny, I turned to you. Pink. <laughs> Okay. I'll do it. Um, okay. okay, I'll turn you back to blue. Thank you. Bless me. Bless you. Okay. Sharon, what do you like? I like brownie. Brownie is oh, one of my favorite foods. And yeah. Did you just say ramen? No, I said brownies. Brownies, brownies. okay. Okay, brownies. Okay. And what else? How about something that fills you? Do you have anything you like uh, uh, other than brownies that fills you? Do you like rice? You like lasagna. Rice? She said lasagna. lasagna. Okay. Huh? Lasagna. Okay. Do you know lasagnas in Japanese? What it is? Think about it. Try to guess. It's uh, actually lasagna. La lasagna. Lasagna. That sounds the same, right? That's easy. Yeah. That's easy, okay. Lasagna. Pizza. Ice cream, okay. So how about uh, Elizabeth? Do you like pink um, or purple? What, what color do you like? I'll give you... Okay, we'll give you pink. Okay. Okay. What do you like, Elizabeth? What would you order in a restaurant? Um. Ice cream and probably pizza. Okay. Same with Johnny. Okay. Ice cream. So you're taking notes. Take notes. Ice cream. That's ice cream. Okay. And uh, pizza. Is pizza. Right. Pizza. Okay. Brownies is kind of hard. Brownies. Do you guys know what's a brown uh, Japanese of brownies? No. No. My guess is that's bounties. <laughs> no, in know. Japanese, an easy way, Johnny, that's close. An easy way to guess is uh, turn that into the R sound. They can't really say it. So say it roll. Ronies. 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 <laughs> Ronies. I can do that. I can do this. Uh -huh. I can do this. I can do that. Brownie, Brownie, that's um, that's uh, the Japanese. Okay, let's 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 see the video. Okay. 
Okay, did you guys see the situation? So this person called Nguyen, she's Vietnamese. Okay, that's a Vietnamese last name. She decided to go eat at a restaurant with Haruka. Haruka, Haruka is a uh, Japanese. Haruka means far, but it it could also be a name. Okay, so they meet at a sh shrine. Okay, shrine is a place that Japanese worship their idol. Right. Oh, yeah. and, and it looked like the shrine. Shrine in Japanese is Jinja. And it looks like it looks like this. I said sorry. They have to. It looks like this. Okay. Have you guys seen shrines? That's that's a shrine. That's a jinja. Everyone say jinja. 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 That's that's how it sounds like. It sounds like Japanese called ginger, right? It sounds like that. It's, but they're right. They're written differently. They sounds like the same, but it's different. So this is uh, how where they worship idols. Okay, so don't go in. Okay. Okay, so they go to a restaurant, right? Do you guys know what this is? So Does this look like any of the katakana or hiragana on your handout? Look at your handout. Look at your handout. A little paper. One of them looks kind of like blue. Or. Yeah, it's actually all kinds. It looks like re. That's it looks like re, but, but mm -hmm. it's not because it looks like it's kanji. So we will learn that later. But this is this means a um, small egg roll. Komakai dama maki. So how about this here? Did you guys see on the left? What do you guys see on the left here? A banner? Yes, what is written on a banner? What is the first part? I can't really tell. It's on no. the uh hira. It's if it's not katakana, it's hiragana. So mm -hmm. it's either one of ways. And this is right. I taught. I told you right. For me, right. Me. Did you guys see this? Me, on the screen. Right. This is me in katakana. Okay, katakana me looks like this, and hiragana me. Looks like this. Let's use a different color. Okay. This is katakana's me. And hiragana's me looks like this. They are, but they're both me. Okay. That's different. So this is saying, can you guys guess what it's saying? Kure, kure miyam. Kure miyam. What does it sound like in English? Because when you see uh, katakana, it's always in English. It always means something that is, there's usually a word for this in English. Premium. The whole thing is premium shohin ken, in shoku ken. So what is saying below, shohin ken means, ken means ticket. Okay, this means ticket. Shohin ken means the grocery ticket. Okay, and nomi inshoku ken. Inshoku means uh, eat and drink. So this means drink. Right, this is, if you uh, have your notes, write down the notes right now. So you can write with me too. So i i means uh, or nomu. This means drink, to drink, okay? You guys got your note? Mm -hmm. This is drink, okay? And how do you say this word? Do you guys know? Mm -hmm. I just I just said it. Nomu. Nomu. 
飲む。or, or in. Because it goes with the, it goes together. Eat and drink goes together, and eat is shoku. So, in shoku. Did you guys see the pink notes? Pink notes means eat and drink. In shoku. So, if you guys、uh, go to a place for the ticket to eat and drink, because in Japan you need to buy ticket. To go to a restaurant or something, you need to get a ticket. You say, In shoku ken. Right? In shoku ken. How do you say, Can I have a um can, can I have an eat and drink ticket? How do you say that in Japanese? In shoku ken o kudasai. Remember what you learned? Kudasai. Kudasai.、Hey. Where, where did you learn it, right? Because you, you have to ask for if it's in a vending machine. there's There are vending machine hamburgers. There are vending machine pizzas in Japanese. Did you guys know that? So you need to buy a ticket to, to say, I want pizza. Okay. So you have to say, Pizza no in shoku ken o kudasai. Can you guys say that? Pizza no in shoku ken o kudasai. Or if they don't have the tickets, you just say pizza o kudasai. Okay, so you guys pick. What, what does this mean? Do you guys see this? Do you guys see the highlighted two words? What does that mean? How do you say it in Japanese? In shoku. In shoku. Okay, means what? Eat and drink. Okay. Eat. 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 Can we type in English? So, eat is tabe. So, if I ask, nani taberu desu ka? Is what would you eat? Okay. So, premium means premium. Okay. Premium. It means premium. Okay. So, did you guys take notes? Can I take this away? You guys take notes? Okay, let's let's watch the video once. Okay, so. Okay. So they went to a restaurant. What did she say? What did she say? She said, Welcome. Yeah, welcome. And she said, How many? Irashai Mase. Okay. So that's the first vocab for today. Irashai Mase. Ilashaimase means welcome. How do you say, how do you write Ilashaimase? Okay, let's write it together. Okay, write it in your notes together with me. E, E, Ra, right? And what's next? Rashai Mase. Rashai Mase. Means welcome. Okay, Irashai Mase means welcome. What is welcome in Japanese? Irashai Mase. Everyone say Irashai Mase. Okay. Irashai Mase. Okay, let's listen to her say what it is. 
Okay, she said, "Irashaimase," and then what does she ask? Pay attention. Okay, I'm going to turn on the bear What did she hear. say? I can't hear her. I can't hear her. Oh, okay. Um. Yeah. She she asked, "Nanme sama desu ka?" Nanme sama desu ka? That's what she asked. Okay. She asked, how many people are there? So, Tari is two. So, so she, what does she say? Two. Two, right? Two, you say, Tari does. Tari does. Okay, and then and then they go in. She said again. What did she say again? I want the book. I want the next book. Okay, what did you guys hear that? No. Um, let me see. How, yeah, yeah. Let me see how this will work better. Um. Okay, let's. Now it might be better. So, can you hear better? これはチキンですかいいえ、チキンじゃありません。豚肉です。豚肉ポークはい、ポークです。じゃあ、これはそれは鶏肉です。チキンです。ああ、これをください。はい。Okay, hey, do you guys hear it? Yeah. Okay, um, do you guys have questions? Right, how do you say pork in Japanese? Pork. No, 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 no. Okay, she's she's she asked it, right? Chicken she, What did she ask? Right? The the Vietnamese girl asked. Korewa chicken deska. So when you ask a question, you always point at it and say Korewa. Right? If you ask if this is pizza, Korewa pizza deska. Right? Can you say that? これは... That means, is this pizza? What does this look like to you guys? Tell me. It's like chicken. Yeah, it looks like chicken. So, so how do you say chicken in Japanese? These are not just your personal books. If you want to say, you know, that's fine. But if you leave, if you want to do something else, you leave behind. I taught you around... Not to. Um, okay. About a month ago, a month or two months, our Why? first two lessons we talked about it. And tori, chicken? tori is chicken. Tori. Tori. Tori ni kudeska. Chicken is meat, right? Tori ni or chicken you can change it to tori ni ku deska. Chicken meat, right? Tori ni ku or chicken. You can just say chicken. Kore wa chicken deska. Can you guys say that? Yeah. Kore and for the chicken, chicken this car, yes, and don't point out your at your siblings and say Korewa chicken this car. That's not good. Okay, <laughs> just 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 point at the food and ask Korewa chicken this car. Right? And then I would say yeah, yeah, butaniku this. Did you understand what I just said? Yeah. 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 What does yeah mean? No. Yeah. No. no. Yep. Good job. Good job. High five. Good job. Mm. Give your gift. You should know it's poor. It's a little clap. Yeah. Buta. Buta niku des. So how about I translate it to 
an easier. Do you guys want katakana? Katakana is the Japanese English, okay? So, ie poku desu. Can you guess what poku is? Is it pork? Pork. Yeah, that's pork. Good job. So, poku, okay? Poku is um in in you know Japanese English katakana. It's pork. But if you want to say it in the authentic Japanese way, do you guys want to do that? It's butaniku. 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 Like real, like it does in katakana. Yes, it's butaniku. Okay, so let's let's write it down. Our vocabs right here. So chicken, right? Body. Change it to a. Uh, what color should we use? Orange. Should we do yes. orange? So, no. when, remember yes. when we asked the question? Kore wa. Kore wa, right? We start with ko and then le and then wa, right? Kore wa. Kori desu ka? So, what does this mean? Kore wa means is this. Right? Kore wa means is this. And chori means chicken. Deska, is that right? Right? So this is. This means, is this chicken right? Kore wa tori deska. Or kore wa. Chicken. Chicken, right? Chicken. That's the car. Okay, chicken. So chicken in katakana is this. And then main answers, main say, no, that's pork. Right? So how do you say that? So you say, yeah, right? Let's do yeah. that. Yeah, pork this. Pork this. Or ye butaniku des. Butaniku. Can you guys say butaniku? Butaniku. 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 Ye pork des. Okay, so you guys learned this. What is chicken in Japanese? Tori. Tori, yep, tori, tori, or you can do chicken. Um, how do you say pork in Japanese? Pork desu. Pork or butaniku. I want you guys to try to say butaniku. 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 Okay, good. Can we continue? Okay, let's let's see what they're gonna order. Okay. So she asked, "Kore wa chicken desu ka?" Is this chicken? And then the girl answered, "Ie butaniku desu." That's pork. Ie chicken ja arimasen. Butaniku desu. Butaniku pork? Hai, pork desu. Ja, kore wa? Sore wa? So she asked, "Ja, kore wa?" Ja, kore wa? And the girl actually did more than that, right? She said, "Right." Yes, please let you move. Chicken janai. So if you guys want to say that's not right, um, right, that's not. Let's say someone point to what's you guys, who's you guys' best friend at church? Well, we just met some other girls. I wanted to Caroline. Yeah, Caroline. Nice. Okay. Enough. Okay. So they ask people point to Caroline and say. Kore wa anata no imoto desu ka? So, kore wa... Caroline wa anata no anata means you. Anata no um, imoto. Imoto desu ka? <coughs> so... 
it's Imoto. Imoto means sister. Okay. Daddy, Everyone say Imoto. Johnny, no. point to your sisters and say Imoto. Point, point to Elizabeth. Uh, actually, Imoto, right? Sharon is younger than Johnny, right? Is it? Is Sharon younger? Yes. Yeah. Okay, so Sharon is your Imoto. And uh, Anesa, Anesa is a uh, older sister. So Imoto means younger sister. Anesa means older sister. Okay, so you point to Elizabeth, say Anesa. Nessa. Can you say that, Johnny? Nessa, yep. So when the people ask, Car is Carolyn your sister? They will ask, Carolyn wa anata no imoto desu ka? And what do you answer? What do you answer? Let you know. The answer is no. And then what do you say in Japanese? Yeah. 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 Yep. I want you to draw it longer. It's not yeah. It's yeah. Okay. It's a little different from English. I know it's hard, but you guys are doing good. So yeah. What do you say? So Caroline, is she your friend? So. Right. So how do you say friend in Japanese? Right. Yeah. Boku no. She is my friend. Right. Okay. Are you gonna say that, Johnny? No, she's my friend. That's how you answer, right? Okay. no tomo ta tomo. Boku no tomo tachi desu. Hi. Yeah, boku no tomo tachi desu. So yeah. when I ask you. Is Caroline your friend? Uh, is Caroline your sister? So I ask Caroline, wa anata no imoto desu ka, Johnny? And then what do you answer, Johnny? So. Yeah. 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 Draw it longer. Yeah. I am yeah. Okay. Everyone say yeah. 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 Kare wa Kare wa means she or that person. Okay, kare is that person. Kare. Kare wa boku no boku no boku means myself. Okay, boku means I. Kare wa boku no tomotachi desu. Tomotachi means friend. Des means is, right? So she is my friend. Okay, everyone say, Kare wa boku no tomotachi desu. Kare wa boku no tomotachi desu. Good job. Okay. So, but if Elizabeth, someone is asking if Caroline is Johnny's friend, uh, uh, if Caroline is Johnny's sister. So what do you say? Think about that, right? So, Because you can't use Boku, right? Because it's not, you're not Johnny, right? So you have to say, Kare wa Johnny no tomotachi desu. Johnny no tomotachi desu. What does it mean? What did you just say? What does it mean in English? Translate to me. Kare is, what does it mean? Kare. Kare means that person, right? Or it's saying to Caroline, right? Kare wa Johnny, right? She is Johnny's friend. Kare wa Johnny no tomotachi desu. Does that make sense? 
So how do you say she is Johnny's friend in Japanese? Karewa, she, right? Karewa. Karewa. Johnny no tomotachi des. She is Johnny's friend. Karewa, she is Johnny. Johnny no, Johnny's, right? Johnny's. So the no acts as the possibly s in English. Karewa, Johnny's no. How do you say friend in Japanese? Tomotachi. So you guys hug together and say Tomotachi. Okay, okay. Tomotachi, we're all friends. Tomotachi, okay. So now you learned how do you say friends, Tomotachi. Okay, let's continue. Sure. What did she say? Yes, did you did you guys hear it? Let's let's listen again. Chicken. Oh. Oh. So she point to the menu and what did she say? That's how you're gonna order in Japan. She point to the menu and what did she say? Johnny, what did she say? Elizabeth. What did she say? Did you hear it? What did she say? May I have this? May I have this? But what is it? What is that in Japanese? Okay, listen again. Okay. Okay. Did you guys hear it? Koreo Kudasai. So if you don't take away anything, you just learned this today. Okay. In restaurant, most important is say Koreo Koreo Kudasai. Koreo Kudasai is May I have this? Yes, good job. High five, high five. That's very good. So how do you say may I have this in Japanese? Kuro kurasai. Okay. Good. Good. Okay. Let's let's keep watching and see how they go. Do you want guys want to see what they she ended up ordering? Yeah. Let's see it. これははい、寿司です。じゃあ、これは天ぷらです。美味しいですか美味しいです。これと、これをください。はい、そばセットがお一つ、寿司セットがお一つですね。はい。それからビールを二つお願いします。はい、ビールがお二つですね。はい、
Your screen is bigger and the, um, the little screen is tiny. So you can't really about, see the video. How about this? Can, can you see this? Can you see it now? Yeah. It's the same size? There. There you go. Thanks. Okay. Okay. Let's let's watch this again. So she's ordering, right? She have two things, right? Can you guys say that? これと、これをください。so they order soba. Okay. So do you guys know what this is? No. No, it's That's sushi. Sushi. Okay. That's shrimp. That's tuna. And a, in the middle is squid, maybe. And a, it's ginger on the left, okay? Okay. Right there? Right there is ginger. This is a shrimp, ebi. I don't like ebi. shrimp, ebi. This is a squid, ika. This is a tuna, maguro. And guess what this is? That's that's soy sauce, shoyu. Shoyu. <laughs> okay, okay. All right. Kanpai. Sorry. So, this is tempura. Okay, sorry. Okay, this is this is noodles, soba. It's a brown uh, buckwheat noodles. Have you guys had buckwheat? Yeah. Yeah, so that's soba. Soba. Everyone say soba. Soba. Soba, okay. Or it could be in kanji. Kanji, it's... Soba. Okay. That's soba. And then. Okay, what is this yellow thing? Do you guys know this? Okay, this is called tempura. Tempura. Okay, tempura. So the kanji is this, okay? It's deep fried shrimp, deep fried vegetables, different kind of vegetable. They deep fried pumpkin too, pumpkin that and pepper. Good. Yeah, that looks good, right? So how do you call it when you want to order it in Japan? What did it say there? What did it say there? In Japanese, I, I just write it on the, I just wrote on the screen. Can you read? Hey, Right, soba. Not be any cold. And what is this? Tempura. 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 Okay. Tempura. That's how you that you see the blue words. Yep. Yep. So that's tempura. So this is how you write tempura in kanji. And this is tempura in. Can you guess what this is? Is it katakana or hiragana? Hiragana. Hiragana. Yes, good job. Good job, John. Good job. Hiragana. Good. Give you a little clapping. Okay, so let's let's keep going. Kanpai. 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 Okay, that means cheers. The beer is not that great, so. No, the food is bad. So you have to dip it in the soy sauce, okay? And don't soak it. Just just put it in once and then take it out and eat the whole thing. That's how you eat sushi. Okay, she said, What does that mean? 
It. Which one says the one with the ponytail? Yeah. Oshi. Oshi desu ka? What does desu ka mean? Is it del delicious? Yes. Desu ka, what does it mean? When you see, when you hear desu ka, what does it mean? Delicious. No, oishi is delicious. Okay, oishi is de delicious. Everyone say oishi. 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 oishi is delicious. Okay. What is delicious in Japanese? Oishi. 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 Okay. Oishi. Good. Oishi. Oishi desu ka? It means, is it delicious, right? Desu ka means question. There's a, is it, or, you know, that kind of question, okay? So what does, what does desu ka mean? Is it. Is it, okay, question, okay. So Japanese is oftentimes opposite. So, kino no yu gohan wa oishi desu ka? When I ask this question, do you guys know what this means? Kino no? You go hawa oishi desu ka? Kino. Kino. You guys can write it. Kino. Let me write it on the screen. Kino. Kino means yesterday. Yesterday. Okay. Kino no. Sorry, don't leave. on my leg. Sorry. You go hawa. Oh, it's okay. Kino no you go Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You go means lunch. Ban go han. Ban go han means dinner. Okay. Asa go han means breakfast. So if I ask. Is dinner good? How do you say dinner in Japanese? So, asa gohan is breakfast. Yu gohan is lunch. Yu gohan is lunch, but dinner is ban gohan. Okay, do you guys see the three things? Asa, go, asa gohan. You go ha. Ban go ha. Okay. So if it's morning, it's breakfast, right? Asa go ha. That's how you say it. Asa go ha. Breakfast. Okay. Breakfast. Do you guys see it on the screen? Hello? Okay, so mite masuka, when I ask you mite masuka, minasan, means did you guys see it? Minasan, mite masuka? What do you answer? Minasan, mite masuka? Is it breakfast? Okay. Are you guys, are you guys looking at it? Mite maska means looking at it. Are we, okay. are we supposed to be looking at this? Uh, yeah, I'm asking if you guys are looking, paying attention, looking at this. Yeah. I, okay. are. So what do you say in Japanese? Hi. 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 Yeah, I want everyone to say hi. Hi. Hi, good. Yi. So, asa gohan wa breakfast. Yu gohan wa Lunch. Lunch, yes, ne? You go home on lunch, so shte. Hiru go ha. Or ban go ha. Dinner. Okay. Everyone say asa go ha. Breakfast is. Asa go ha. Lunch is. You go ha. Yugohan. And dinner is ban gohan. Ban gohan. And gohan, do you know what that means? No. Rice. No. Meshi means rice or meal. Okay, it means rice or meal. So 
Did you guys realize it? Uh, breakfast, lunch, and dinner in Japanese all end with gohan. Because what is breakfast? Asa gohan. Right? What is lunch? You gohan. You gohan. You gohan. Okay. Um, and what is dinner? Ban gohan. Asa. Asa means morning. Did you guys know that? Asa means morning. If you break up the words, morning meal. What is morning meal? Asa gohan, right? What does asa, asa gohan mean? Breakfast. Morning breakfast. Exactly. It's, it, breakfast is good. Morning, morning rice, morning meal, or morning breakfast. But you don't say morning breakfast because that sounds silly. So it's just breakfast, right? What is breakfast in Japanese? Breakfast no nihongo wa nan desu ka? Asa gohan. Everyone say asa gohan. Asa gohan. Okay. Okay, and the same thing, you... You is afternoon, right? How about you gohan? What's the meaning of you gohan? You is afternoon, right? You is afternoon. Stop. Right, and hiru hiru gohan means dinner. Hiru is dinner. Hi, hiru gohan, hiru. Is night okay? You do. You guys got it. Yeah. Okay. Let's continue. Okay. Oishi desu ka? Oishi desu. Hi. What did she say? Hi. Oishi desu. Oishi desu means desu means it is. Right. Desu ka means is it. Right. Haruka san, soba wa. Okay, let's review. What is this? How do you say this? You guys, Koreo Kudasai, write this in your notes. May I have this? Is Koreo Kudasai. Okay. And let me know when you guys are done writing it on in your notes. Okay, I hope you guys still remember how to write these. Also have rolls too. So whatever you want to do. Don't know if Almost. Almost, okay. You are always the fastest. I know that. Can done. Sharon is probably halfway. Are you ready? Well, then go put your pencil. I don't know where it is. Well, then go get a different one. Yeah. This be writing this down, sweetie pie. I'm all done. Right. You're all done, Johnny. Good job. Good job. If you guys remember this next lesson, I'll send you guys some candies. Okay. And I want to see you guys' homework too, if, if I can see it. So probably your dad can take pictures and send it to me through email or something. Get back and get answers. Okay. Okay. Sharon, you ready? Sharon, are you done? I mean, get started. Not yet. Okay. 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 To bathe, Susie. Okay. What? is. What? What is Koreo kudasai? 
Johnny, Elizabeth? Well, I don't know what I yeah. history, What is kudasai? What is koreo kudasai? What is koreo kudasai? May I have this? Yes. Okay, good. Elizabeth, what does koreo kudasai mean? When you go to a restaurant, you want to order the tempura, right? Remember the tempura? Well, I'm asking her to bring it back up. Sure, she didn't bring it. He... <laughs> Right, you point at the picture and say, Koreo kudasai. Right, Koreo kudasai. It's okay. Okay. Sharon, are you done? Okay. She's, she's not she's done yet. Dead. She's not done yet. Okay, we'll wait. Okay, while she's writing, you guys um, go here. Okay. So she asks, Oishi desu ka? And you, you say, Oishi desu. You guys see the screen? Oi, she does. What does that mean? And then make sure you put your stuff away. It's delicious. Right. It's delicious. Okay, write it down. Oi, she does. It's delicious. Oi, she means delicious. Das means it is. Okay. Oi, she does. And if you guys have time, when you guys play, do you guys play a home? Right? So you guys can play a restaurant setting and ask in Japanese, right? Right? How many people are you coming? Maybe Johnny would be the waiter, right? And then Sharon and Elizabeth can come in to the Japanese restaurant. And then uh, you can ask your daddy to look up Japanese food. And then there will be a menu. And then you know, you can say, Koreo kudasai, Koreo kudasai, right? And then you guys can pretend to eat and say, you know, oishi desu ka? This is, is this good? Sushi wo oishi desu, oishi desu ka? Soba wo oishi desu ka? Right? Kore wo chicken desu ka? Kore wo gyuniku uh, desu ka? Kore wo putaniku desu ka? So that you guys can do that. All right? Did you guys understand what I just said? Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Oishi desu, what does it mean? It's delicious. Okay, okay. Move on to the next one. So she asked, Nanme sama desu ka? Right? Hitori desu. Hitori desu. Right? If you go back. Nanme sama desu ka? Hitori desu. Okay. sama desu ka? Hitori desu. That means nanme sama desu ka is what? Sharon, you can just go lie down, okay? Okay. sama desu ka? That means how many people are coming, right? Nan me sama desu ka? Nan means how, how many or how. Okay. So nan means how. And me means like people, like how many people. Nan me sama. Nan me sama. Sama is like a. Name sama, it's like a honorific, right? How many of you, Mr. and Mrs., right, are there? That's ga. How many of you are there? Okay. So, nan means how. May means, you know, many people. Sama means like the honorifics, right? And that's ga. Nan me sama that's ga means how many of you, Mr. and Mrs., are there? Okay, how do you say when you when the uh when you work in a restaurant and you have to ask people how many of you are there? What do you say in Japanese? I didn't write down the first one yet. What what is the first one? Sorry, what did you say, Johnny? It's kinda 
名様ですか ?Means how many? Oh, well, well, okay, we'll keep going. 何名様ですか ?Means how many? Oh, well, we'll see. Hitori des. Hitori des means one person. Okay? Hitori, it's one person. Hitotsu means two. So I think we remember Japanese counting, right? Let's go, go back. How do you count one to ten? Let's count solely. Ich, ni, san, shi, go, roku, nana, hachi, kyu, ju. And then let's count it back. Okay? Ju, ten, right? Ju, kyu, hachi, nana, rok, sa, uh, go, yon, san, ni, ichi. Did you guys got it? Did you guys got it? Yeah. Okay, you guys count it to me. Itch, me, sa, yo, go, look, yana, hachi, you, you. Good, good job. Backwards. Ju, ju, nash, nan, hachi, nana. Yep, keep going. Very good. Let's count it. Ju, kyu, hachi, nana, roku. Do you see my fingers? Yeah. It's five oh, yeah, fingers. Five. Can... Yeah. So what is, what is five in Japanese? Go. 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 No. Oh, well, you go back, right? What is this? Young, son, Young, son, And then last one? And then, Ichi. Ichi, Ichi yay! Give yourself a big hand. That's good. I'm proud of you guys. That's very good. Okay, so how do you say 11? Elizabeth, 11. Ichi. Sorry, what? Yeah. Well, first you it say the one. one. Yeah. 11 is 10, 1, right? It's 10 plus 1. Each. Everyone say ju each. How do you Jew say each. we have we have seven people, right? Let's say you guys, the whole family go to Japan. We have seven people. There are, 12, there are eight of us. Eight, oh. eight of you. Okay, eight of you. Okay. Eight of you guys. How about eight of you guys go? So you say hachi, right? Hachi mei des. Okay, we have eight, right? The the restaurant person asks. So they, they ask. She asks, "Nanme sama desu ka?" And then you have eight. So how do you say it? Hachi mei des, right? You just replace the nan, right? Nan is how, how, right? And mei sama desu ka means much of you. So you can just say hachi mei des. Okay, everyone say hachi mei des. Hachi mei des. Okay, how about there are uh, 11 of yours? 11 of you. How do you say 11 in Japanese? Ju each. Ju each. Ju made us. Right? Ju each made us. You guys got it? Ju each made us. Okay? So let's continue. Hitori is one person. Hitori is. これをください。はい。これをください。美味しいですか?美味しいです。美味しいですか?え、let's hey, count people. Tori.
Okay, that's one person. One is what? One is Ichi, right? Right? So, but how do you say one person? Hitori. Okay, everyone say Hitori. 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 Okay. Hitori. Okay, okay, he's going too fast. Okay, what is one person again? Hitori. Hitori. Good. <laughs> How do you say two person? Remember the two girls? Right? Yeah. Let's say Elizabeth and uh, Sharon, you guys went to a cafe. And you guys are just having your girls time, okay? So you ordered, you come in and say, right? Let's say you guys are discussing about the Japanese orphanage, okay? Or the church, right? You're, you guys are starting a childcare program in your church. And you guys are talking in the cafe. And the cafe person, let's say I'm the cafe person, I say, uh, How do you answer? Elizabeth, answer. You have two people, so you say, Right? Can you share it? Okay. And here's how you write it in Japanese, okay? They don't, they don't include it. Kutari das means two person, okay, right here. If you guys take notes, take notes. And I'll send you guys the recording too, so that you guys can hear it. Okay, are you guys ready? We'll go to three person, okay? Are you ready yet? Jimbi or Ideska? Hi. Hi, okay, you ready, okay. Sanin. Okay, now only one and two are special, but after that, they all they all sound they, they sound like the normal ones. They sound like the normal counting, right? Sanin. Three persons, because each ni san, right? So how do you say three people? Sanne. San nin, okay. San nin. Nin means people, okay. Nin. San nin. Okay, continue. Yonin. Yonin. Yonin means four people. Okay. So, how do you say one person again? Story. 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 Good. Story. One person. So this this means person. Okay. If you guys see this, this means person. Did you guys see this too? Oh, I can write it out too. You guys, you guys can write it in your notebook. This means people. Okay. It's people in, in kanji. Okay. Here. Okay, Hitori, how about two person? How do how do you say two person in Japanese? Hi. Sorry, what? Hitori is one person. Good. About two person. Hitori des. Hitori des. Hitori des. Good job. How about Three person. Sunny. Sunny. Good job. Good job. Elizabeth. That's good. Very good. Very good. I need to send you guys some candies. But don't eat it at all. I will let you, uh, your dad and mom manage the candies. Okay. And you guys answer the question correctly. You guys can get the candies. Sunny. How about four people? Four Yon, right? Yes, your need, your, your need, right? So, four person, your need. Okay, how about five person? Can you guys guess? Um, right, because after one, two, and three, one, two is after one and two, they're all the same as usual, they go back to normal. Right? 
Yes, because five person, what is five in Japanese? Each, ni, san, shi, go, right? Go. So how do you say five person in Japanese? Go. Go, go nin. Go nin, right? Nin means people, right? Five person means go nin. Okay, can you everyone say that? Go nin. Oui. Okay, we're almost ending here, so step fast. Okay, let's count articles. Okay. So these are counting article, okay? Um the difference between one, two, three, four, five, because those are numbers. Those are for like you guys writing money or something like that, right? Nihaku, right? Nihaku yen. If you guys want to pay two hundred dollar um 200 yen, you have to say nihyaku. But, right, if you're counting things, right, one cherry is hitotsu no cherry. Hitotsu, eh? Hitotsu. Hitotsu. Futatsu. And two is futatsu. Mitsu. Mitsu is three. Mitsu onegaishimasu, right? You go to the grocery store, you ask for apple. Mitsu no mingo o kudasai. Right? Mitsu no bingo kudasai. Because you might ask, uh, Mr. Ming, why can't we say uh, san, san no uh, bingo kudasai? Because that, that doesn't make grammar sense. Because that is for uh, san, san hyaku, san sen, san, um, let me type it out. San hyaku, right? You guys remember what hyaku is? San hyaku. That means 300. Hyaku means 100, right? San hyaku means 300. Okay. How about ichi hyaku? Ichi hyaku. What does that mean? 100, right? Hyaku means 100, right? So... Uh, Sanhyaku means 300. How about uh, Sen? Do you guys remember Sen I taught last time? Sen means 1000. So if you see San Sen. Uh, I don't know, look around. It means 3000. <laughs> okay. So, but if you count things, you want one apple, what do you say? Hitotsu. Hitotsu. No. Make sure you go party first. Bingo. Oh, kudasai. Right. This is this is the sentence of today. So write it down. Hitotsu no ringo o kudasai. Please give me one apple. Right. Right. And how do you say two apple? Please give me two apple. How do you say that? Johnny. Ni. Right. Ni is it ni is good. Ni is for the currency, for the counting numbers. But if you count actual things, let's say you're counting one piece of uh wood here, right? Totsu, okay. And if you have two, it's tatsu. If you're counting things. Okay, it's no different in Japanese. So we say tatsu. Can, can you guys all say it? Two apples, please, is tatsu no lingo o lingo kudasai. Kudasai. Okay, what does all kudasai mean? Koreo kudasai, what does that mean? Okay, let's let's go back. Koreo kudasai, right? This is a good test.
What does that mean? May I have this? Okay, so if you ask ひとつのリンゴをください, what does that mean? ひとつ means one, right? May I have what? May I have this? That's it. But I asked no kudasai. Ringo means apple. And what does hitotsu mean? One. One. So what does the whole sentence translate as? Hitotsu no ringo o kudasai. One apple, please. Right? How about hutatsu no? Hutatsu no ringo o kudasai. Hutatsu no ringo o kudasai. How do you... What, what does that translate into? Hitotsu. Hitotsu. Right. Hitotsu no ringo o kudasai. Hitotsu means two, right? Two apple, please. Mitsu. Mitsu. How many cherries are here? Three, three. Three. Mitsu no cherry o kudasai. Please give me three cherries. How many cherries are here? Four. 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 So yotsu. Everyone say yotsu. Yotsu. This, it sounds like yon. But yotsu means four pieces or four things. Okay. Yotsu. Itsutsu. Itsutsu is five. This is hard. How many cherries are here? Five. 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 Itsutsu. Okay. Okay. And we're going to look at types of meat. Do you guys want to learn how beef, what, what beef is? Yes. Yes. Okay. What, what is beef is? Let's hear this. Gyuniku. What did he say? Gyuniku. Gyuniku. Right? Gyuniku is beef. Gyuniku. Do you guys want to see the hiragana of it? Yeah. Gyu niku. Okay. Gyu means moo. The things that do moo. What are the things that do moo? Cows. Cows. So gyu or ushi. <laughs> ushi is cow. Okay. So gyu niku is beef. What is gyu niku? Beef. 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 Okay. Gyu niku is beef. Buta niku. Okay. What does butaniku mean? Pork. Pork, okay. What is pork in Japanese? Butaniku. Butaniku, good. Toriniku. So what is chicken meat? Chicken is tori, right? Toriniku. Let's hear him say again. Gyuniku. Gyuniku. Butaniku. Toriniku. Toriniku. Okay. What is chicken again? Tori niku. Okay. Yuniku is beef. 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 Good job. Buta niku is pork. 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 Tori niku. Tori niku is sakana. Chicken. Chicken. Sakana <laughs> is fish. Okay. Everyone say sakana. Sakana. Sakana is fish. They have an advice. So, water and green tea, green tea and soba yu. Soba yu is the um, the juice of the buckwheat noodles. The hot water that they boil the buckwheat noodles at. They are free. Okay. Muryo, muryo is free. So even though you eat noodles, slurping is uh is not bad manners. Slurping is good because um people like slurping in Japan. So you don't have to do this in America. But in Japan, if you want to, you can do this. You don't need to. You don't need to. You don't have to. So it's okay. People won't look at you weird if you don't slurp. It's it's okay. So
Okay, that's today's lesson. All right, let's review what we learned, okay? Let's review what we learned. You guys are you guys are ready for a nap, I think. So okay, let's 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 look at what we learned, okay? Oh so you you niku. What does this mean? You niku? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go back to the beginning. When you go into a restaurant, beef, yes, yes, good. So waiter would ask when you go to a restaurant, okay? When <laughs> you go into a restaurant. How do you say restaurant, right? Tokuji dokoro. Sokuji Dokoro is restaurant. Sokujoko no no. Sokujoko o ku no toki. Or high rounded ta no toki. High rounded ta no toki is when you enter the restaurant, okay? Waiter would ask, Nan me sama desu ka? So, what does this mean? Nan me sama desu ka? How many? How many? Good job. Good job, Johnny. Big hand. How many of you are here? Oh, it's Elizabeth? Okay, Elizabeth, good job. I can't, I can't see you guys because I don't see the boards. So, you guys clap when they answer the question correctly. Okay, Sekai is correct. But um, how many of you? And what do you guys say? Let's say there is four people of you. Right. Let's say there's two, two people. All right, one. If if there's only you alone, Johnny, it's uh, what? What do you say when it's only Johnny, right? When Johnny went to a restaurant after work in Japan. Story this, right? Only one person. So what if uh, Sharon and Elizabeth go to talk about the church in a cafe, right? What do they say? How about how, how do you say two person? We have two person. Tari des. Tari des. Good job. Good job. Very good. Tari des. It's two person. Okay. How about Johnny? You guys decided that when you guys get older, you guys are meeting together to eat together, okay? And talk about the church and stuff. So how do you say free person? It's harder, okay? I'll give you this. San nin. Everyone say san nin desu. San nin desu. Okay, that's what you guys, when you guys go to Japan, you guys gonna say san nin desu when you guys go together. Okay, and how about four person? Right, Ming decided to come. You Ming built a church there, and you guys, we I would say Ming is like, uh, sama, I will treat you guys. Okay, plus Mr. Ming. Okay, so if I decided to come, what are you guys gonna? What am I gonna say to the waiter? Right, Yonindes, Yonindes. Everyone say Yonin. You need this because four is each ni san yon, right? It could be she or yon. So it's yon yon need this. When you're counting people, you use yon. Okay. How about when uh, your mom came too? Go need this. Okay. So, right? How about if your dad comes too? It is roku need this. You see, it's easier. How about seven? Um, we haven't learned that one yet. How about you guess? Because nin is uh, people, right? How about seven people? <laughs> Thank you. 
but seven is sh sh cheat, right? Cheat. Seven people. Nana need this. Nana need this. Or she need this. Both works. How about eight people? What is eight in Japanese? Uh, hachi. Hachi needs this. Good job, Elizabeth. Hachi needs this. I want you guys to, to say something too, Sharon and John. Okay. Okay, so that's that. Good job. And uh, what color do you like? What color should I do the restaurant? Oh, uh, let's do green. Does green look good? Blue? Yeah, blue. Blue, okay, let's do blue. Okay, so now you ask, okay, now you told them how many people, let's say there's four of us, Yonindas, and then uh, she said, uh, Please, this way, is please, this way. This way, please, right? She'll guide you. Okay, so that's what the waiter would say. And after that, what you do is, you know, you sit down, right? Sit down and look at menu, right? Or if they don't have a menu, you, you ask, Japanese uh, menu are usually on the wall, okay? Let me show you guys. They're usually on the wall. Right, uh, Japanese menu on wall. Okay, so this is this is what it usually look like. Okay, let's let's look at this. Do you guys understand this? How about this? Right, it's it's hard. But this is a this is what a Japanese restaurant looked like, right? This is what they were ordered. So let you know if you guys have time, you guys can go back to this. But this is a uh, edamame. Kunse takuan ke. This is smoked fish, right? And I can't see that shiro kombu. This is salt seaweed. Daikon. Salad. Yo, Carrot salad. Tori no karage. What is tori? What is tori? Hello? Fish. No, tori is chicken, right? Yes, that's right. Tori, karage means fried. Okay? Fried chicken. Tori no karage. Tonkatsu. Okay? I don't know if you know this, tonkatsu. Uh, we might go through this next time. Tonkatsu means deep fried pork. Okay, let's, let's look at that. Okay, that's what tonkatsu is. Do you guys see this? Does that look good? Does that look yes. good? Yes. Tonkatsu, right? Good, good. Okay, so that's tonkatsu. And this is buta, right? This is something related to pig, buta, right? Buta. Right? Samo. If you learn how to read, uh, you know, katakana, salmon no yaki, saike yaki. Saike yaki is a special type. Yaki means, um, this is the kanji for yaki. Yaki means, have you guys heard of teriyaki? No. Teriyaki is like a style to make chicken, okay? They put it on the, with soy sauce, they uh, stir fry it. So yaki means like 
burn or like, you know, barbecue it. So this is barbecue with salmon, okay? And kaisen don, kaisen don, kaisen is seafood, don is rice, okay? And miso shiri, this is a miso sauce, miso soup. Katsudon, katsudon is, um, this is tonkatsu, right? Katsudon means um, deep fried pork or chicken with rice. Kare rice. Can you guys guess what this one is? Kare rice. Curry rice. Okay. Anyway, that's that's a little glimpse of what restaurant in Japanese would be like. And so when you sit down and look at menu, uh, when you see a pizza, what do you, when you see something you want, what do you say? Yeah. <coughs> right? When 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 Sharon see the brownie, right? Or or Elizabeth saw pizza. Let's say you guys want to order pizza. And there's the Hawaiian pizza there, but you guys don't know how to say Hawaiian pizza in Japanese. Do you guys know that? How do you say Hawaiian pizza in Japanese? I don't know. Okay, so, but there's easier way. You don't have to know everything in Japan. You can point to the menu and say, say what? That's the most important word you need to learn today. Pizza or kudasai? Pizza or kudasai, hi. right? Pizza or kudasai, good job. Or you can say, what? May I have this, please? What is? What do you say that in Japanese? Kore is this, right? Kore o what? Kore o kudasai. Kore o kudasai. Everyone say kore o kudasai. Kore o kudasai. Okay, okay, that's the lesson for today. Okay, so we'll review it next time. So let, let's pray and end this, okay? Okay. Why, why don't you pray, Elizabeth? You pray. Dear Lord, I, I thank you that we have had time to be together, even if Mr. Ming is, isn't here in Pennsylvania. I, I, I think you that we could still um, keep we could still keep on doing our Japanese lessons. And I I I thank you that that Mr. Ming is teaching us and that we have been able to do it and that we would ha all have a good rest of the of the day in Jesus' name, Amen. Amen, Amen. Johnny, Sharon, you want to pray too? Sharon's not here. Go ahead. Dear Lord, I thank you for the to our Japanese system, and I pray that we'll keep on doing it and we will be diligent at it. And that oh, we will learn it well. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Sharon, you want to pray, pray too? Sharon's not here. Oh, Sharon's not here. Okay, let me pray too. Um, Holy Father, we just thank you for this day. Uh, um, Father, thank you for this day. <laughs> Sharon, Johnny, Elizabeth, thank you for Johnny, thank you for Elizabeth, thank you for Sharon. Minasano, thank you, Nihongo, thank you, Zehi, Shuku, De, Atai, Kurasai. Please bless everyone's Japanese studies. Uh, I missed all of them. Thank you for this. You have a good plan for everyone. I know that. Uh, please bless their good work and help them continue to work hard, study every day in the Bible and also in Japanese. Shorai please so that they can come to Japan and start an orphanage or start church work and help people to know the good news of the Bible. Yeah.
。イエス様の名前を祈って。In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. Okay, thank you guys. Remember, remember just to, to do homework, you just read it and say it, okay? Read it and say it one time after your Bible reading, and that's good. And if you have any question, um, ask your dad and mom, and they can email, me, okay? Or you guys can call me. Okay? Okay. <laughs> okay. Sayonara, sayonara. See you guys next time. Mata kondo. Sayonara. Bye bye. See you next time. See you next time. Sayonara. Mata kondo.